Hi guys, my name is Johan from Restoration That Bike. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to replace your traditional bicycle light bulb with an LED. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. I also have a Facebook group for people who are into bike restorations or just want to chat with other people, like-minded people, and you're welcome to join that with the help of the link in the description below. One of my favorite bicycle parts has to be the Bicycle Dynamo and Vincent Bicycle Lights. But anyone who's ever ridden a bike with incandescent light bulbs knows that sooner or later, that little yellow light will pop, leaving you in the dark, literally. The light bulb holds a small tungsten filament. Running electricity through this filament causes it to heat up and emit light. And with use, the tungsten slowly evaporates and settles on the inside of the encasing bulb, blackening it. And the fact that the tungsten evaporates over time means that sooner or later your light will stop working. And what I've noticed is that since I ride pretty fast, the bulbs have an extremely short lifespan. The obvious choice when upgrading your lighting setup is to go for LED lights, which stands for Light Emitting Diode. I won't bore you with the details behind the technology, but suffice to say it emits four times as much light using the same amount of energy. And since the technology doesn't make use of a slowly dissolving filament to create light, they last much longer as well. Those two factors combined is the reason why besides caged pedals and color pins, using incandescent lights for a bicycle is truly an inferior option. The installation process is just as straightforward with LEDs as with normal light bulbs. That being said, because of how they are constructed, the LEDs I bought would prove to be too big to be held in the tiny compartment of the rear light. I doubt you'll ever have this issue with your front lights since they are generally much larger than your rear light. And make sure you point your headlight not straight forward and definitely not in an upwards angle because the brightness of your LED will blind oncoming traffic, which makes for very dangerous situations. One of the most obvious downsides of replacing bicycle light bulbs with an LED is that you'll lose that characteristic yellow light. You won't notice it for the rear since the encasing is red plastic, but you will for the front. But what you'll get in return is four times as much light that lasts you 10 times as long. So that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Consider joining the Facebook group and I hope I can welcome you again for the next video. Bye for now.